Hey, 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 what's happening, everyone? Captain Chris Johnson here. Woo, what a week. What a week, what a week, what a week. I'm still crazy about it. Um, I'm excited. Michael Williams came on yesterday at 360 and just did what he normally does, blew us away. So, Michael, again, thank you for that. Always nice. I do want to do a quick shout-out for some prayers from Azar, uh, Azar, excuse me, Azar Khan's wife. Uh, can you give her some prayers, guys? She needs a lot, a lot of prayers right now, uh, and I'd appreciate it if you shout that out. Uh, really, really a lot. Red just did an excellent live. Actually, Jane got a point from me. She made a funny. <laughs> Actually, I, here's what happened. If you weren't there. Oh, my God, I'm apple cider vinegar. I said uh, <laughs> she sits in the back seat uh, on the couch. Couch behind and you can just see her head. And I said, I see her head. <laughs> and what did she say? We can't miss yours. <laughs> Very funny, Jane. You get an extra point for that today for ripping on Big Head. I love it. Uh, but yeah, Red, check out Red's YouTube if you missed it. Marty DeGarmo has lost his voice, so he might be doing later a live. Not sure. I'm sure he'll put it out there as soon as he does. And also tomorrow... I'll be coming on in red spot at 11 o'clock because red has a doctor's appointment at 11. He will do his live after Marty DeGarmo. If DeGarmo, you know how Marty is. Yeah. It ain't, it ain't red. It ain't nothing to do with his air conditioning. He just talks too damn much. That's all. <laughs> so everyone give him a little, little break today. He don't need to be talking. Uh, wow. A lot of really cool names on here, guys. Nice to see you all. Let me tell you a little bit what's going on today. Um, let me get, get it in order here. Mar uh, Marty's not coming out till later. We don't know why, when, uh, four o'clock comfort cop for Andy and Collins, which is always great. And then we have, and if I miss something, I apologize. We have the, uh, Roblin live eight o'clock every night. Plus, uh, at nine 30 or nine 40, the O Minnow show, uh, which is really cool. I've been going to that a lot. Not tonight and tomorrow. You know what's happened in the next couple of days. And then 10 o'clock tonight, Engineer Mike will be, was supposed to be me and Marty. And because I forgot I had my uh, my uh, wedding rehearsal tonight with my daughter, I had to cancel. But Robin Noble stepped up to the plate. So she's going to go with Marty. That's at 10 o'clock. I believe they're going to be talking about targeted traffic. And I told Mike I would come on uh, Monday. Monday, and I'd be on his show, and I apologize. I completely forgot about tonight, actually. Uh, so I, got, I think I got everyone. If I missed, I'm sorry. Uh, we, I, I want to do a correction. I guess one of us, Ding Dongs at 360, said something wrong, and Ash, had, Ash corrected us, which is okay. We were calling it like this noise suppressant thing, and we had it all goofed up. And and it was funny because this, this really got Ash going yesterday. He was talking about, oh, connect. He was talking about the speech to text and the noise cancellation. Now, he is like freaking out about it, excited. He said, I am completely satisfied. I am thrilled beyond belief. All right, his words. You go watch it. Yeah. Go watch it on the video Marty posted in the updates. You'll see. I hope you all watch that because he said some really cool stuff. And we'll touch a little bit on it. Um, let me give you an idea about the noise cancellation. Now, you all know Marty, how loud his house is, right? With all his grandkids and everyone running around the TV going, it's going to help him out immensely. And to give an example, my dog always starts starts barking. At any given, someone can walk by, the mailman can come, a bird or a squirrel could be hopping in front of the house, and next thing you know, he's barking. I can't wait for the noise cancellation button uh, because I'm going to love it because one thing I don't like is – my dog barking and everyone can hear it because maybe they can't hear me, but we are, I'm going to, I'm going to warn every one of you. We are all going to have to get used to, and this was funny because Ash brought it up. Like, well, like Marty will say, shut up to his dog kids or his dogs that are barking me. I'm always trying to be nice. Belly. Don't, don't bark. Bell. Come on. And we're not going to have to do that no more. In other words, it can be as noisy as you want behind us. And we could just keep talking. We just have to get the mindset of, all right, they can't hear it. Just keep talking. Don't be saying shut up. Hey, I'm on a live. All that stuff that you've witnessed for the last 
three, four, five years when we were doing lives. So I'm really excited about that. And Ash is really excited. Um, he also talked about, and Brett touched on, I want to touch on it a little bit more, uh, the debit cards that are becoming, you know, there's some countries that don't have any of that stuff. So one of the questions that uh, Anna asked me uh, the other day was uh, about the wallet. Can we put money in which you can, but not yet because it's not there. But they don't have cards. They don't have cards in their country of Samoa, right? And boom, Ash, what does Ash say? Ash, I, I swear he's he was in my head. He he started talking about this debit card, and she's texting me, Chris, thank you. Oh, my God, thank you, thank you, thank you. Now, I want you to remember in uh, two years, maybe a year and a half, two years ago, I had mentioned about the wallet. And uh, can you imagine hotel chains, airports, uh, airplane companies, gas stations, party stores, and they all have what we call the wallet. In other words, they're going to join up as a, back then a founder, but now a reseller still can have them. And they're going to have, listen, business, business wants cash immediately. Any business, when you use a credit card, debit card, takes two or three days, they pick up, they got to pay a percentage fee. Now, I don't know all the total rules on the, how Ash can do this debit card thing, but I know this, I'll still say it again. Wallet to wallet. Imagine, and this is going to happen. Don't care what you think, naysayers. When everyone, every business finds out about the wallet to wallet instant cash, they're going to want to be in it. Not only are they going to make money in the back end, but they're going to get money from their business instantly. Not wait and not get charged percentages and boom. Now, this debit card is just a plus. Absolutely a plus. Teron, thank you very much for the super sticker. It's just a plus. And I'm real excited about that because I'm the one. I got in a little bit of trouble when I said it a couple of years ago, and I said, "No, no, no. This is stuff that Ash has touched on prior. Uh, it's in the works always. You guys have no idea what's in the works. And let me tell you something. There's always in the works. But when I saw Ash say, "I am," you know, he, there wasn't a word big enough to tell him how excited he was about just those speech to text and noise cancellation. So, uh, of course, that fires me up. Um, I think I can, yeah. Now, I'm not going to be on too long today because I have lots of errands to run today. My daughter is getting married on Saturday. Tonight's the wedding rehearsal. Uh, and in the next two days, I got a lot of running around. I started early this morning, actually. Uh, and I want to get it done. So I'm not ignoring any of you. I just got to get this, this last kid out of the nest, married, and then it's Chris Johnson time. All right. It's back to Chris Johnson. I'll be fishing, boat, and you'll be seeing some lives in my little boat. Uh, on the lake, in the sunshine, uh, I need to break free. Um, uh, Michael and Red brought it up also. Michael said some very important things. One of the favorite things I think we all like this when he said, a passive is worth the weight. All right? And passive is worth the weight. In other words, a lot of people have complained or said what's taking too long, but it's worth, listen, I've been in positions where, I waited, I waited, I waited. Boom. It's always worth the wait. There's a reason why there's always a wait time. Most of the time, 100% of the time, is because things are being developed in that process. But how Michael said it, worth the wait. You will be shedding tears when this all goes down. All right? When this goes down, listen, I'm going to be laughing, crying, screaming, hollering. Uh, I'm going to be just... I'm. Listen, I'm always excited, but when it actually starts going down, oh, my gosh, I, it's going to be hard for me to control my emotions, all right? Because you know what I'm thinking about? Thinking about my son, my daughter, their families, uh, my family members that don't know I got in positions, what they're going to feel like, even though they never paid attention to me or, or didn't believe in it. Can you imagine that? Listen. Here's a guy, I will use my back scratcher, my favorite thing in the whole world, because I can never get there, right? And this guy says, you know, three years ago, I got him a position. He just don't know it. And next thing you know, everything gets going. I'll even wait a couple months so some things will add up into his wallet. And then I'm going to gift it to him. Hey, remember that thing you told me I was crazy about? I'd like to gift this to you now. And boom, they're going to like, oh, oh, oh. boom. You think they're going to turn it down? <laughs> do you think they'll be excited 
Do you think they'll understand what why I was doing this? See, a lot of people don't understand why we do this, but they will soon. What did I say the other day? I know what's coming. You know what's coming. As a founder, uh, it's an amazing thing. And I can't wait to see the looks on people's faces when we actually start doing our paid products, which I really think the way Ash was saying the other day, uh, he's blown away. Like I said, we got a sneak peek of O Connect um, from Ash a couple weeks ago. And Marty said it actually really good. It's hard to explain what we saw, but I, I think I say it perfect. If we were on O Connect right now and I was cooking a hamburger or a hot dog or a steak, something I just ain't eating right now, you'd smell it. That's how the clarity is in there. The, it's just perfect. And I was blown away. Like, oh my God. I was, I thought the first trial was pretty darn good. Uh, the second one's going to be even crazier. And we're all part of it. I keep telling people, you're part of something that's bigger than you can imagine. Every morning when you wake up, you better be thinking, God, thank you. Thank you for the, the breath in my lungs. Thank you for this wonderful thing called and passive. And we're going to change lives. That's, that's enough for me. You know, actually, money doesn't grow on trees. Everyone knows that. Money doesn't last forever. I'm, when I first seen a passive, I started really thinking about it. Wow, this is just like a one-time payment. You're going to be continuously making money. As people join, as customers come in, resellers come in, it's going to be nonstop constant. Now, I don't know. I can't say how fast it's going to be. I think in some cases it's going to be very fast. And in some cases it might be a little slower. It depends on the rotator. But if you're out there doing for yourself right now, it's going to be a lot. You're going to get to that, as Mike Ellis says, you're going to get to that place you want to be a lot quicker. But you don't have to do it. I had a person say that to me today. Chris, I, I, you don't have to do it. Please stop worrying. Put the worry in your back pocket. Sit on it and out of you. Get rid of that. Stop worrying about it. It's all done for you. Remember that. Non-stop. And nobody knows how fast or slow. But who cares? I don't care. Look at Look at one year from today, say we, we started pay products today. Hypothetically, it's only me saying it. One year from today, let's just say that uh, you've generated, let's, let's, let's just be silly, $100 a week, one year from today, $400 a month for doing nothing. Now, I'm just making up this number, but I want to let you know, there is people that's never done one thing on Unpassive, but sign up, get in, because we said just get in. Right. And and they got their ninety seven dollars back. But I want you just to think about this. Someone is going to pay you to run your business, which is everything. And you just got to sit back and watch it grow. How's that? Listen, you're going to watch uh, on passive Ash Mafar, the tech team, O Media, every one of them, the Muhammad Times Four. All right, they're watering your seed seven days a week, 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. All right, now a lot of people keep forgetting that this is non stop, folks. Now, the biggest thing I want to say that I want you all to remember okay, multiple streams of income, huh? multiple streams of income under one umbrella under one roof, under one little world here that we belong to. Stop thinking about one thing, guys. That You you have no idea how many multiple streams of income Ash Mafara has set up for you, all right? And people are getting stuck. I say it again. They're getting stuck in one thing. Here's my, here's my best advice I can give you. Don't worry. Be happy. You don't have no worries, guys. Let it happen. It's going to be great. Ash Mafar is everything he's told us about commissions is all going to come true. It, it's not just the products, guys. The products are phenomenal, but there's so much more, and he's talked about it. And a lot of people keep still forgetting that. You know, I'm, uh, I always, hold on. I'm always blown away by that uh, when I think about it. I, you could hear me the other day when he's talking about the debit card, and there'll be a charge for it, and you're going to get a commission on that. Uh, you heard me. Listen, 
Multiple, I said, I didn't even realize I was unmuted. Multiple streams of income, my gosh. Non-stop. Asma Farah just isn't setting up with products that we're all going to use and everyone's going to use and we're going to get phenomenal things from it. I mean, one or two of them, actually all of them, uh, what did he say? O-Connect is going to set you. O-Connect is going to get you just O-Connect. And we haven't talked about the other 50 million things that he has that's going to create another income for all of us. Thank you. That's what you should be excited about. All right. What did Mike say? Excuse me, Michael. Worth the wait. Worth the wait. You've waited your whole life, guys. Your whole life has always been a wait. But this time, this time it's just not okay. Okay, today's here. We got paid products. Imagine it grows and grows and grows and it keeps growing. It don't stop growing. And what are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> you're going to the beach. You're going fishing. You're planning a, a probably a really nice vacation. But what you don't realize is it's going to take a while to set in. Okay. It is going to take a while to set in. And you're going to be thinking about, wait a minute. Maybe just for example, you went out and you wanted to buy a, a boat that you always wanted. All right. Then you got to figure out about gas in that boat, the upkeep, where you're going to keep it. You don't have to worry about that. All right. Um, and passive is just going to keep giving. That's what people don't understand. To all the naysayers out there, this isn't one time. Oh, you're going to get paid. It keeps growing. Is it going to be success overnight? No. Listen, there's 8 billion people in the world. Here's my, here's my words. If I get 1 million people that want to come in and say, Chris, I'm interested. 1 million people out of the 8 billion people, guess where I'm going to be? I'm going to be in heaven. In heaven. Now, I think that number is endless. I think every one of us have the opportunity to get 1 million, 2 million, 3 million, 4 million, 8 billion people is a lot of people. When people find out and businesses find out that you can save money, make money, who wouldn't get in this? All right. But yeah, we got the people that are saying, oh, this is never going to happen. Guys, I hate to tell you this. Let me let you in on a little secret. It's already happening. You understand that? It's already happening. Uh, just watch your, your CEO. And I don't know when he's coming on next. Uh, I don't need to hear him say anything else, to be honest. I've said this many a times. It's nice because he always gets me going. The debit card thing really blew me away. The uh, noise cancelization, speech to text. He was saying it's so fast. It's so furious. It's unbelievable. All right. And this is coming out of him. And you can see this. Now, Ash Bafara, my personal self, never really, he kind of stays calm, but he was excited. He, he, he showed some excitement this time. Uh, he's laughing. He's having fun. That's what he wants for all of us. Laugh and have fun. And that guy, is, someone asked him, when do you sleep? His words were, uh, I'm really not, I don't have the time to sleep. Uh, it's not in in the cards right now. In other words, his I, his mind is, I can't sleep. I got too much to do. I'm sure he takes a cat nap here and there. I know his schedule is pretty heavy. When's the last time you guys sacrificed your sleep? Right? For, for the world? When, when I say Ash Mafar is going to go down in history for being the kindest man in the world, the world's going to find that out. And I, I'll say it again. This is the Ash Mafar I want the world to know about. Not the, uh, okay, we use Elon Musk. There's the richest guy in the world. Right? No, no, no. Ash Mafar is the nicest guy in the world. Um, you're not going to see him. <laughs> I don't know what he's going to do. But I know he's, he wants to give his money away. Help people out. And he's going to document it. Uh <laughs> I don't know what else to say anymore is you got to be excited about this. All right. Worth the wait. Take away your pain. Make it better for our children. How many of us, how many of us said that over the years? The rule is 
each generation is supposed to make it better for your kids. That hasn't happened in many years. I'm sorry. It hasn't. Maybe if you were in that situation, you got lucky, but it isn't happening. I, like I said, I just went to the gas station uh, to get myself all ready for traveling this weekend and all the stuff I got to go. And I'm looking at gas for, I think in Michigan, it's 376 a gallon. All right. Now I already filled it up the other day. I put like 25, I, I drove it for a day and I had to put another $25 in it. And then I was talking to Red this morning. You're welcome, Robin. And then I was talking to Red this morning about what, how much gas costs over there in the UK. I'm like, oh my God, it was another dollar fifty higher than us. And we start talking about how gas prices take away from the family because they know they got to get to work. After they fill their tank, they don't have a lot left anymore. We're going to change that. Okay. Here's my personal opinion to all of you. In the future, you're not going to worry about gas prices. All right. In the future, if you are in debt now, that's going to go away. All right. I'm saying it. Chris Johnson's saying it. This is the kind of faith that I believe in and pass of what it's going to do. In the future, you're going to be helping a lot of people out because you know what it's like to struggle, strain. You individuals, which I call my angels, which are everyone in, in a passive lately, okay, are going to change this world. All right? This world needs a lot of work and a lot of change. Boom. Enough said. Do you understand that? Chris Johnson said it again. You individuals out there, you founders, you resellers, you customers are going to be part of changing the world, changing the history for the better. Period. Period, period, period. All right? That's the truth. And, and I, I was watching this morning two guys talking. One of them is a big talk host, which I love him, and I can't think of his name because my brain's fried. Uh, he was talking about he is going to spend 85% of his money. I'm not leaving my money and five, five or 10% of money to his kids because he wants them to go out and do it on their own. And I listened to this three times and I like what they had to say. Uh, it says, it's not what you leave your family that makes them great. Hear me out now. It's what you leave inside them. If you leave enough in them, you don't have to ever worry about them. Now, what, what are they saying? I took it as, okay, my kids are going to see me go out and help people. All right. Uh, solve problems for places that's never seen things. My kids are going to see what I'm doing. I don't want my kids to think, oh, dad's got all that money when he dies someday. And I want them to say, I want to do exactly what my dad's doing. Same thing for you founders out there. I, I just want to, listen, if you leave something good inside somebody, it never leaves them. Now, if you're going to go out and do bad things, eh, same thing. But if you do good things, especially for your family, they're going to carry that tradition on. Now, that's a real legacy. I already know what my kids are going to get monetary wise. Okay. I already know that, but that's not enough for me. What this man said woke me up today. I need to instill in their hearts the right way. Just like a passive doing it the right way. I honestly uh, believe that. Um, if you, you can't make up your mind what you want lately, that's the greatest thing about a passive. You don't have to worry. What do I want to do? Hmm, I don't know. Enjoy life or work the rest of my life? Do I want to help people or just be a greedy SOB? I choose the helping people. Uh, do I want you to go out and experience everything that life has to offer? Yes, I do. I want you to travel here. I want you to travel to places you only dreamed of. Because right, I tell you this a million times. Every one of these paradise places, there's someone in the background, young kids, who don't have a nickel to rub together. They're hungry. They're starving. Go enjoy yourself. And while you're enjoying yourself, change their lives. You'll be amazed what you're going to be able to do when you have income coming in constantly. All right? No more uh, like, like tipping your waiter. waiter. I've always been a great tipper. All right? Absolutely love leaving a waiter or waitress a great tip and letting them know you were a great server. That's what we should all be doing. We should all be great servers. Now, I'm not looking for a tip, 
but it sure feels it sure feels good to uh, take care of a server that took care of me. Remember that. A great leader is a great server. That's something I don't ever want you to stop thinking about. Okay. All right. Let me say the birthdays real quick. I know Marty's not coming on right away. Uh, Ufa Knox and Hagen, happy birthday. Rebecca Lee, happy birthday. Emily Joe, happy birthday. Tracy Richards, happy birthday. And Dennis Phelps, happy birthday. Once again, prayers for Zarkon's Khan's wife, please. And anyone else that's having troubles, if you're sick or if you had a death in the family, we're always there for you. Uh, that's life sometimes. Uh, guaranteed life is death, birth and death. It's what you do in between them that's going to make a difference. You see, my goal is I want to go to heaven. <laughs> and you can be the greatest person in the world, but that doesn't necessarily get you to go to heaven. I'm going to do whatever I can to make sure I get to heaven. Whatever it is, I want to be there because that's where I want to go. And I pray that for everyone. I don't want to go down the rabbit hole, guys. Never want to go down a rabbit hole. And passive has filled all my holes. Bottom line, on passive has filled all my holes. I don't have to worry where I'm stepping, where I'm driving. I know that it's going to be there for me and for every one of you. All right. Now, Marty is not coming on at noon today. Uh, I'm not sure when he's coming on. Let me see if he's texting me. Uh, no, but I know as his voice is shot. And, and technically, is Dawn, I wrote it in my title, Dawn hit his voice. And she, she, don't, she ain't going to give it back to him. But hopefully... He'll, he'll be, I know him, he'll bounce back in a couple hours and he'll do a live. Marty cannot ever not do a live. He's, he's dedicated that much. Uh, I have a lot of respect for that. Even when the guy's no, no air in his lungs, his voice is shot, he still gets out there and does it, does it, does it. So uh, prayers to you, my brother, Marty. You know I love you. So guys, keep this going, all right? Share the good news of this contest. Uh, look around you because there's people that need your help. Maybe you just don't see it. Pay attention. Look a little bit more around you and your community. Your community needs a lot of help. You just maybe don't know it. Just because you have a good, there's a million other people who don't have a good. Matter of fact, I heard this advertisement the other day about a guy driving by himself and his insurance company says, hey, man, you got to slow down a little bit. Oh, he says, it's just me in there. I'm not worried about it. I go as fast as I want. There's no kids in the car. And the insurance said, listen, the stats are all around you, all around you. There's at least 25 kids in the car right now. Animals. There's living people, old women, senior citizens that are all around you. Just because you're in the car alone doesn't mean you can't hurt somebody. You're thinking about, oh, I'm not I'm only going to hurt myself, nobody else. You're surrounded. Listen, the world is like that, All right? Because you're swimming in the ocean don't mean a shark ain't going to bite you. Remember that. You are surrounded with things. Think about everything you do. Keep your mind pure, all right? And when you're going a little faster down that road because it's just you in the car, and I do it. I know I do it. I'm sorry. But remember, statistics show that there's people all around you that you can hurt. So keep your actions good and right. Be kind. Be nice. There's a girl on TikTok, um, and I can't think her name. They sell T-shirts, be kind to everyone, and I don't, I don't know her name, but she was born later in life uh, with autism. She didn't speak till a very uh, older age. Once again, the doctor says, oh, she's never going to be right, man. She's helping her parents run a business. Uh, T-shirts, be kind to everyone. It's really cool. I absolutely love seeing stories like that. I know Rob Gorman told me the other day that the biggest trucking company in the world, they, they shut the doors. They, they basically looked at the people and said, bye, bye. And that breaks my heart when I hear stuff like that. So all you truckers out there, guess what's coming to help you? Guess what's coming to ease your pain? It's called a passive. Check out, if you're a truck driver and you know any of these people in there, ask them all about a passive. Ask them. To check out the link that you can win some uh, oh, prize up to twenty one thousand dollars. The first prize is ten grand. All right, we're here to help. We're here to take away the pain. Remember that. Okay. Uh, 
That's right. That's right. Uh, <laughs> Jane Helm, Cynthia Deering, Bimmel Daz. Kevin Rutledge was number one today. And Kevin Rutledge, thank you for uh, advertising again. Remember tomorrow, I'm coming out at 11. Marty will be 12 if his voice is there. And Red will be after that. Oof, I always forget all this stuff. Ah, uh, Pravon, Casey Zevenbergen, Marina, what's happening? Tehran, Marina Toth. Uh, Rose, what's happening? Chandon, Patricia Parent, uh, Afanixiani, it's a tough one for me. Pravon, New Hardware Mart. Hey, there's a new one. How you doing there? <laughs> Aseta, M. Kelly, Frank Rowe, uh, Burgess. Jurgensen, Raju, Akash, uh, Pravon, Cena. Woo, look at all these new names on here. Yvonne Finn, how you doing? K-Mo, Catmo, what's happening, Catmo? Uh, Rob Lynn live uh, with Lynn and Rob. Eight o'clock, don't forget. Frank Rowe, Jane Elms, Deborah Rule, John White, Bill Must, if you're here. Uh, Julie Wen, Robin Noble, uh, Christina, how are you? I like that name, KKM, Christina Koskella. I think that's how you say it. I hope I did. Uh, Henry Horn, how you done? Bugs scatter when the light is shining on them. <laughs> I like that, Henry. That's pretty good. Thank you, Brother Chris, for reminding me of some important things which are in store for us. You are very welcome, Rose. It's not me. Uh, Ash, Ash, Ash Mafara. He, he tells me everything I need to know, which I love. Uh, Frank Rowe, Bali, who, what's happening? Uh, Ginger DeSanto, how you doing? I love that last name. I like your first name too, Ginger. I got a cousin named Ginger, but she just doesn't like her name. We call her something else. <laughs> uh, I'm Kaylee, what's happening? I think Janie Helms, a set of, ah, I'm bouncing all over again. Uh, I can't pronounce, but anyway, Marty's coming out sometimes today. Go enjoy your day. I got to go run some errands. Uh, <laughs> Robert Tatillas asked me how Marty is. If Robert was watching my live, he would know that, wouldn't he? But he's not watching my live, is he? <laughs> All right, guys, you never have to watch my lives. Uh, they're recorded. I would like if you'd subscribe to my channel and click the like button. That's cool. And if you don't want to, that's cool, too. I love every one of you. On Passive is coming. All right. On Passive is here. Uh, you can make as much noise behind you on a <laughs> on the computer because noise cancellation is coming. I'm gonna love that. I I even said, well, how close is it? Like I dropped my back scratcher, and he he actually said, "What's cracked me up?" I, I knew he was gonna go here because I didn't want to go there. But like, even if you pass gas, <laughs> I'm gonna. There's a lot of things that's gonna. People are gonna be. There's gonna be a lot of strange faces first. Because people aren't going to be used to it. You know, it's, it's going to be really wild. So, all right. I love every one of you. God bless. I will be doing a live Friday. My daughter's wedding is Saturday. Um, we'll see what happens. I'll be back on Monday for sure. I love every one of you. God bless. And uh, to my daughter who's getting married to the Mills, couldn't have been a better family. They're phenomenal. I really love them. So, all right. I got to go. I love you. Go spread the word, guys. I'm passive this year. Marty DeGarmo, whenever you want to come on. All right. Bye.